so so now that you've really like had this meteoric rise, are there different components to your to your rapping? Like some is freestyle, but then you've got like an album that you're working on that's all super polished and Yeah. Uh so I have like a project that's out called Contents Under Pressure that I did a few years back where there's some like written material on it. Um but for me, I, I love improvising. Like, I love freestyling. And even when I'm in the studio uh, making songs, I think, I find for me, like, the best process is to improvise, you know? And even if afterwards we pick the best chunks and rearrange right. things, maybe fix a couple things up or re-record segments and sections, it's like, for me, I can't access the best stuff unless I'm improvising. All right. You know, it's hard for me to sit there and write. Is it true that on your YouTube channel there are videos that are eight and nine hours long and yeah. you're freestyling for the entire time yeah there's a 10 hour one actually That's yeah insane. i'll tell you i'll tell you how That's that insane. happened uh so <clears throat> what happened was during the pandemic i did a lot of live streaming like on youtube and twitch and stuff like that and there was a big audience for it at that time because you know everyone was home watching content you sure. know people were you know depressed and people needed some kind of a uh, something to sit down and enjoy so um a lot of people were showing up for the streams and so my YouTube channel was growing a lot. So we hit 500,000 subscribers and I was like, all right, you know what? I'm going to do a marathon stream five hours for 500K uh, subscribers, you know? <coughs> so we did the five hours and that's nuts. Yeah. Which was crazy at the time. That was like the, the craziest thing I could imagine that I'm going to go for five hours straight, you know? And so what happens is toward the end of it, like you enter this crazy kind of like flow state, almost like, you know, you don't even feel your body type of thing. You know what I mean? You're just like <laughs> totally just like in it, your mouth's just moving, whatever. It's like, it's almost like a tribal kind of fucking vibe, you know? Ch and, chanting or yeah. 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 speaking in tongues. Yeah. Exactly, exactly. You're speaking in tongues. You're speaking yeah. in tongues. And so when I'm in this state of like, you know, borderline delirium, then someone in the comments like jokingly was like, yeah, I can't wait for six hours for 600K. And I saw the comment and I'm like, fuck it, we're doing it. Six wow. hours for 600K all the way up to a million, seven hours for 700K. I like committed to it on the stream without yeah. having my full wits about me probably. You know, it wasn't the smartest thing necessarily. But and, and the irony being that that just made it all so popular that yeah. next thing you know, you are hitting a million and yeah. you gotta do 10 hours. Well, the benchmarks came faster and faster which was the scary thing like I thought I'd have a few months before we had to do the six hours but it was like next month six hours next month seven hours few weeks later we did the eight and then the nine and then the ten so I did all of those lengths of time for each of those 100k landmarks from 500 to a million 